most of you probably know Montana Black, right? It's a streamer from Germany. He seems like a very chill guy. This is an unboxing he did. He's opening, what's that, Chroma 1? That's a decent case. He f***ing shits himself. Look at that. <laughs> okay. But look, he gets a knife. Oh my god! Oh my god! And look what knife it is! Did he say that he f***ed his pants? He did! <laughs> This is a Bayonet Doppler Ruby Statrack. Here's his inventory, look. His name is Mr. Feaster, okay. Here it is, okay. It's not any type of Ruby. Look at the flow. 0 0.004. Statrack Bayonet Ruby. If you don't know, let me show. It is the fourth best float in the world for a Statrack Bayonet Ruby. Isn't that insane? If you didn't know, this one and this one are both owned by the same guy who I sold my AK661 to. Basically, this is the biggest biggest collector in CSGO. He's got probably the most expensive inventory. He's crazy. Here, this is his same account. Look, it's him with a horse picture. He owns the number one and the number three. These two are basically locked away forever. So technically, the number one doesn't exist because this guy's never gonna sell. He's a billionaire and he does not care about the money, I guarantee you. Same with the number three. So these are kind of out of circulation. They exist, but they don't really exist, right? So this one is the number one. 571 days ago, so this has been the, the tradable number one for like two years now, until now Montana Black opened this one from a case, which is insane. Why don't rich dudes sell? You say that you have 20 billion dollars, why would you care about your inventory, which is 4 million, let's say. 4 million is literally 0.02% of your money. It's pocket change. No one cares. People who, I guess, have huge inventories that just let it sit, I think they are cooler by just just letting it sit and it being basically like a museum than if they just sell it and scatter the skin. But either way, uh, this is an insane unbox by him. And basically now we have a number two tradable that track by Net Ruby, which we haven't had for like years. That knife he opened could have been a gut knife rust coat battle scarred. It could have been really shit. <laughs>